Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. In today's video, I had someone email me. They couldn't figure out what the difference was between the Smart Fill tool versus just the Fill tool. Well, you know, there's a couple of Fill tools. Like, here's your Fill tool. And you get Uniform Fill. And then you would go pick a color. But the difference is a pretty big difference. We're going to use this for the fill tool. So if I go over here and left click, which would tell it to fill, it's going to fill the entire object, no matter what color I tell it to fill. And that object is 100% yellow through and through. If I take my smart fill tool and just fill in this, I'm going to get just the part I filled in. The object's still there. I'm just getting a fill. Now, one word of warning. If you ever want a different color, don't go, well, I really want it to be black. And refill it. Because now you have two fills. If you want that original one yellow, just go up now to your fill tool. Because it's actually made a shape in the shape of that fill tool. I hope that is understandable and here let's go let's just fill this one in with red so now I've got two shapes completely filled in where if I do a color fill or a smart fill with red I'm only going to get that shape they both have their purposes this one is just for filling in an object or text and changing now the I guess the only well, there's not really an advantage, but you can easily change the colors of your fills. And you can do the same thing with a smart fill tool. Just don't double fill. Because the, com the computer doesn't know that you're trying to... Well, I hit outside the box. The computer doesn't know that you're not wanting three fills. Anyway, hope it helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.